They now on a partnership between the city of Charleston and the Gullah Geechee community and a project to preserve their culture. After a pre-proposal meeting today, the city will now be hiring consultants to work with select members of the community, achieve a diverse range of cultural and historic preservation goals. Our Emily Johnson joining us now live outside where that meeting was held this afternoon. Emily, how will those consultants be chosen? Well, Ann and Roth, this afternoon, officials explained how these consultants could connect with 25 members of this cohort who represent 24 different historically black and Gullah Geechee communities so they can work together to create and use this project to the best of their ability. Charleston City Council approved an award of more than $100,000 back in April to help pay for the project and held eight informational sessions across Charleston and Berkeley counties from July to August. 180 people attended those sessions and provided feedback, highlighting which topics are most important to them. Examples of the types of project. Well, one, I think it affirmed that there's interest in this type of support and there's a strong interest um, and there's a need for this. Um, this type of effort. The cohort was chosen in October and tasked with documenting historic sites and districts, including nominations to the National Register of Historic Places. A consultant will work with the cohort to define and implement which projects are most important to these historic communities. We want to know that this is a very sensitive journey that we are embarking on, and it has to be done in a way that people feel respected. Uh, people feel honored and they see themselves as part of the decision making of this process. These qualified consultants need to have expertise in Gullah Geechee cultural heritage and historic preservation to submit a proposal to assist with technical assistance, capacity building and community engagement. We support this to be as much as possible a community led process and be accountable to cohort members to make sure that um, they are really being supported to uh, tell their own story and to identify for themselves what is um, historically and culturally significant. The deadline for proposals is on January 8th, with the city determining who will work alongside these cohorts by the end of January or beginning of February. Reporting live in downtown Charleston, Emily Johnson, Live 5 News.